I hope your day goes amazing as it should go. So today we discuss two of the moms, Liv's Web of Lies and My Jazzy Life. And let me just tell you real quick, Mr. Gerard, Mr. Webb, he is continuously dishing out these subliminals to live and i'm telling you he is giving her a word without even saying a word if you get what i mean so be sure to watch this video in its entirety to get some of my thoughts and read some of the comments and see a little clips you know so with that being said let's roll the clips so little miss web of lies thought it was appropriate to post this on Instagram as she usually does with the kind of photos she posts. And let me just say it has nothing to do with her physical appearance, with her size, but let's just be honest, it's tasteless and senseless. You're a mom, you claim to be this great mom, get it together. You have two girls watching you, but let's continue into some of the comments. Friends, let me tell you, this woman on the top gave her a word. And it's so true. No man worth anything wants a woman who posts pictures like this. Like, it's really tasteless. And I can't with the second one, the fupa fupa hanging everywhere. I cannot. Honestly, it was the granny panties for me. Like, I don't know about y'all, but I'm really sick of seeing them. So here we go with one of the idiots starting off with the bullshit talking about its swimwear you can clearly see those are maroon colored grandma drawers like stop it you know damn all that ain't no swimwear and this comment explains my point in case robin is so grown and i honestly blame olivia let's be honest i'm sure majority of the time robin is the one snapping these photos and you're basically telling her and ryan that it's okay for a woman to post on Instagram in a pair of panties, like get it together. You set the example. If you set a good example, she would act her age. So I know a lot of you guys don't have Instagram, so you come to YouTube to see the photos in the comments. So yeah, this is another photo that she posted. And let me be honest, I don't like the lips. They're giving blowfish. Like, I don't think they're appealing at all. They just don't go with your face. It's just like everything looks swollen. It's just not a good look. I would like, you know, I would stop. And don't get me wrong. When you come through beat, you are a very beautiful girl. No shade, but let's call a spade a spade. Yeah, I just wanted to put that out there. So then she posted a photo in this unflattering sunday school dress in my opinion i don't know easter sunday whatever you want to call it um you know i don't like it that much but i'm just confused at this point like are you tupac or a jehovah's witness like <laughs> i really do believe you're bipolar i don't get it i i just don't i don't and i totally agree with this woman's comment classy sexy if that's what you want to attract that's what you need to be but I mean, don't get your hopes up, Miss Chocolate, because <laughs> we're talking about live here. Okay, friends. So this next clip is a post that Gerard made on Instagram. And let me just tell you, again, he gave her a word. Let's get into it. I am a woman, but let me just say mr webb i feel you so heavy on this because we've literally watched it unfold on every vlog every live every chance she got she tore you down for the entire internet to witness and it's unacceptable she has never held herself accountable but yet continuously calls you the narcissist this is what i cannot take about this so-called woman and honestly, I commend you, Gerard, and I am happy for you because if I were in your position, I would have been on the first thing smoking. Do you hear me? <laughs> Good luck to you, Mr. Webb. Let's continue.
So someone commented on that post that Gerard put up and they said she is a good mother. And let me tell you, Miss Lousy Honeybird gave them a word, okay? <laughs> okay, friends. So out of this whole ghetto <laughs> Instagram montage, if you will, this was the comment for me. It was the pulling out the gun for me. This man was accused of being an abuser you could have ruined his life you put that on the internet you were so shooketh but you're the one pulling out guns you backed out on him please make it make sense and i'm so mad that i missed this because i honestly don't recollect the situation wow that's all i have to say about this is wow Okay, friends, so that concludes a liar's ghetto Instagram segment. It's the ghetto for me. <laughs> so moving on, we have my neck bone life. And she was live. And let me tell you, the people gave her a word. And she was just answering mad, irrelevant questions, trying to be sarcastic, throwing shade, looking stupid, per usual. So with that being said, let's get into it. It was the level of disrespect for Aiden for me. And this person is absolutely right. Like, pick up your baby. He's asking to be held. At least for a minute of two, it will not kill you. <laughs> no, they did not say, I hope you don't spend all your stimulus on that bum. Well, let me just break it to you guys. She's going to. Unfortunately, she is. She's going to. Okay, T loving and living life. Give her a word, sis, because how are you buying a house when you're on here dry begging for every and any holiday? You can't even buy a tire, but you're buying a house. Yeah, uh-huh, we believe you. And frankly, even if you plan on renting, I don't think you have the funds for that either. Let's just be honest. It's a little pricey to rent a house, let alone the upkeep, which we know you will not be keeping up. In response to this um, comment on a live chat, I keep telling you guys, it's all for the camera. It is all for the camera. She does not give Amaya affection when that camera's off. Destiny, girl, don't hold your breath. It'll probably be a cold day in hell when you see her go and get those girls here professionally done because the money is going on neck bones and Nikes and muscle tees for her and hips. Petty Bone Jones, girl, please give her a word because the sarcasm was so dry. So when this person said, apparently your area isn't that great if you have stalkers, Miss Jazzy sarcastically replied, oh, my area is great. The people just come over from the bad areas, basically coming over here and just ghettoing it up. Oh, sounds familiar because everywhere you go, you ghetto it up. <laughs> Let's continue. Don't hold your breath, Tamika6409. There will be no zoo or aquarium, just the complex pool, I can assure you. And when this person said, you can't live off tax money, she again sarcastically replied, oh, you sh you're right, you can't live off tax money. Jazz, stop capping as if you know that. Because right now, you are acting like that tax money is like was in your account already like you just you're going crazy you're being frivolous you don't know how to act you're trying to buy houses and cows and land girl please stop okay back in black 77 please give her a word sis Are your channels in your mom's name um my channel is my jazz guy those are the ones that are in my name i don't get what you're saying but yeah y'all see there you have it when that person asked her if her channel was in her mother's name do you see how she sort of became like 
a little disoriented um uh my channels uh the my jazzy life channel that's in my name girl you just gave yourself up and now we all know that your channels are definitely in mama neckbone's name and she is getting a piece of the pie buying a house is cheaper i thought about it that no i've been up for a little bit um i was cleaning actually jazz you know damn well you did not think about buying a house you couldn't even buy a tire sis a house yeah okay i can give you a hug no 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 give me a hug And this right here is why for the idiots who continuously defend her, she couldn't even pick that baby up. He literally begged. It's really sad. And this last commenter hit the nail on the head. Chris sits on the video game all day, laying around, being unproductive because he is a bum. And that is on Moses' sandals, period. Okay, friends, I just wanted to incorporate a few of those comments because when I tell y'all, they were giving her a word on that live stream and a little miss dusty life had nothing to say she tried to be sarcastic so bad so bad but it wasn't working because as the other girl said she just isn't bright enough like it just doesn't come off funny or sarcastic it just sounds dumb but yeah she's sitting there with her head high all cocky because she got that stimulus and um taxes and you cannot tell her nothing child but yeah that pretty much concludes this video friends you already know the vibes like what you like comment and subscribe if you aren't already and i will talk to you down below and in the next video